Our first guest is a multiple Emmy Award winning comedian, actor, and writer who this weekend hosts Saturday Night Live with musical guest Fun. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Louis C.K. <laughs> Before we get into anything, I want to congratulate you on all those Emmys. Oh, my goodness. Thank Congratulations, you. buddy. Thank it was so happy. Well deserved. Well deserved. Uh, uh, thank you, thank you for being here. I know. How, are sure. you, how are you dealing with this hurricane? Are you going crazy? Or? Well, it sucks, you know. It's yeah. A, really, I hate it. I just, yeah. on behalf of New York, I just want to say, hey, Sandy, f*** you, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's very nice. Yeah, that's very, very nice of you to say that. Yeah, you can. Yes. You can no. say that. The New Yorkers will do. They, a lot yeah. of people want to say that. New Jersey too. I think you can oh, speak New, for them if you New want Jersey, to. New Jersey, you Sandy. There you go. There you go. <laughs> you do it both. There you go. There you go. <laughs> They'll appreciate that. That's right. Have I'm you have for Connecticut, uh, Sandy? I really wish you hadn't. <laughs> 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 very, very nice. Uh, sure. Connecticut. Sure, yeah. sure. Uh, uh, but you yourself, have you been affected at all? Well, I, I, uh, Mike, I, I live uptown and uh, more th like above the line of, of misery that's in New York City right now. Yeah. It's 39th Street and down, knows no power, There's nothing. No lights at all. It's and up where I am, it's uh, it's awesome. No, uh, <laughs> it's, it's, it's like nightclubs oh, and like. Yes. <laughs> Pot free. Yeah, no. Champagne. Yes. Bottles. Yes. Bottles above, right. you know. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Alize out of the faucet. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty good. Cool. Oh, my God. Is that amazing. how you say it? I don't yeah, know. Sure. Yeah, sure. So, uh, yeah, no, it's been okay. I lost a boat. I had a boat, and I lost my boat. Wait, um, what? I had a boat, and I was watching the news, and they have those piles of boats, you know, where they just yeah. look stupid now. They're in a pile, like it's next to a tub or something, you know? <laughs> yeah, flew, yeah. Just, and so I called the, the pier where I keep the boat, and I go, is my boat in a pile? And they go, yep. <laughs> Talk to you later, man. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> so make sure. It's like it's ruined. They go, yes, it's totally ruined. <laughs> oh my god! I yeah. didn't even know you had a boat. I did. I bought. I got. You know, I had a pretty good couple of years, and I shouldn't have bought a boat because I didn't have enough money to buy a boat. I had enough. I had exactly enough money to buy a boat. But that's not when you buy a boat. No, 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 no. No, that's a, no, no. You, no. you buy a boat, and my accountant tried, like sent me down. He's like, dude, when you you have a first, you buy a mansion, and then you buy a, a like three cars, yeah, a couple of horses, yep, and then you got to take a boat. That's what yeah, a boat that's is. A, that's the order of yeah. But you, I was like, just as soon as I had enough money to buy a boat, then now I'm broke with a boat. Like totally bought a boat. Yeah, I dude. rent an apartment and I have a boat. Yeah. Not, <laughs> that's, yeah so you yes. have a house. No, yeah. I don't have a house. You rent an apartment and I you own a, a boat. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Wait, but do you use a boat in New York? Well, it's like, the, you know, we're on the Hudson River, and, yeah. uh, and uh, yeah, and you don't need a license for a boat. You just, they give it to you, and you just go out, you're the captain, That's and you go That's not true out. at all. Yes, you, it is. It's completely true. You need a license for No, you for don't. No, you don't. What? You get in, and That's you go true, like Louis, this, I and think... you go, whoa, no, 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 no. <laughs> That's completely 100% true. That is true. so not true. That's 100% true. That is true. not true yes, at all. Yes, it is. Look you it up. You can't do that. Well, you don't take anyone out on this boat, do you? The first day I had it, my kids and I went out on it, and no, we got oh my we did. goodness gracious! And we got stuck in the mud for 12 hours because we had to wait for the tide to come out. Because I don't know anything what I'm doing. <laughs> but, uh, <laughs> You're not a licensed. No, no. You're not a captain. No, yeah, of course. Well, I am, but you don't have to do anything to be a captain. <laughs> I think Just you're buy wrong. Just Google all the money you have. this. Okay. But and then I had one night I went out, me and uh, uh, Chris Rock's a friend of mine, and him, my manager, and I, uh, I said, you guys want to go on the boat? And my manager's like, yeah! And Chris is like, I don't want to go on a boat. Yeah, Chris Rock doesn't want to go on no, a boat. No, he hated it. Yeah. But he came out, so we went out to the Hudson River, and I took them down to the Statue of Liberty. You can just go right up to her. Are you yeah. sure? Yes. It's not true. <laughs> I don't believe it. I don't think and you're I'm allowed to do it. this boat. Stop, stop driving like that. Yes. Whoa. Your eyes get crazy in your driving. Yeah. <laughs> Why are you driving a so boat? So I get to the Statue of Liberty with Chris, and Chris is like, "Can we get go home?" And um, and then he goes, "Look out!" Because there's this big thing in the water, this big dark thing in the water. And I look at it and I don't know what it is. It's huge, like ten feet across, round thing, it floating in the Hudson River. And I I thought it was a boat, like a raft. And I said, "Who's in that?" Like, hello. And uh, then it starts moving towards us. 
And Chris says, get, get, get out of here. So we start Wait, getting he's out. He's to take off? Please, yeah. What if it's like someone from the Titanic? Well, this is yeah. what I thought it was a thing. I thought it was a huge thing, and I called the Coast Guard on the radio. I said, hello, is anybody there? What uh, do you, I, what is the radio. <laughs> That's what you were, you were operating. Hello, uh, You were yes. doing dit, 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 da, da, da. Dit, yes, dit, you were doing young. Morse code. Yes. From I your said, boat. is anyone on this channel? And this woman goes, this is a Harbor uh, Coast Guard. Who, who are you? And I go, my name's Louie, and I, I have a boat. Ha, ha, ha. And she goes... <laughs> And she goes, she says, what's your phone number? So I give her my phone number, and she calls my cell, and she says, what, what is it? And I go, there's a huge object in the, in the harbor, New York Harbor, and it's headed towards the lower Manhattan. That's what was going on. It was just going towards lower Manhattan. This is all true. Yeah. And, my, and I go, and she goes, what does it look like? And I say to my manager, what does it look like? And he goes, dude, it looks like the top of a submarine. It totally looks like the top of a, kind of an old submarine, but yeah. like a submarine hatch going towards... Like a hunt for Red October. Yeah, so I said, submarine. you know what? I know it sounds kind of weird, but it looks like there's a submarine headed towards Lower Manhattan <laughs> right now. <laughs> what are you doing? And so they go, all right, well, we have, we'll send a boat. And I wait like 20 minutes and no boat comes. And I call and I go, hey, is anybody coming? And they're like, we got, you know, a lot of... And I said, okay, I am saying that a submarine is attacking Manhattan <laughs> right now. I'm saying it to the U.S. Coast Guard. You should not have a so license to drive here. a boat. <laughs> so no they, they, attacked they, by submarine. they sent a boat, and this boat comes and shines lights on this thing, yeah. and they go, uh, yeah, it's a mooring ball. It's been there since 1975. <laughs> it's just a thing. It's always been there. Yeah. Well, how are you supposed to know? Uh, no, I don't know anything about boats. Why would I know that? <laughs> You own a boat and you're driving it. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, sorry. And yeah. So now, it, so now the boat is uh, after. It's a big piece of crap now. There yeah. you go. Yeah. All right. More Louis C.K. Yeah. when we get back. Yeah. <laughs>